Greetings, programs. This is Wretch. Welcome back to Infernax. And in the last episode, guys, we explored Stormheim Shore and inadvertently destroyed a bridge, which caused a man-made disaster that killed a ton of villagers. Fortunately, we had the power of the save point on our side, and that whole thing, that whole calamity, did not happen. But um, in other good news, we're able to use our lightning spell and summon the castle here in this area. And from what you guys were telling me in the comments, I am not about to have a good time. Which makes sense. All water dungeons are inherently evil. So uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what's in here and apprehensive. But before we do that, let's go ahead and upgrade. Get mana four. And see what fresh hell awaits us here. Stormheim Castle. Okay, whoop. Oh no. I think we saw we saw these guys before. They were jumping out of the water when the dam that didn't happen happened. So they're gonna jump. We got harpoon launchers here. At least I can kill them in one hit. Oh god, are they gonna jump up during the the gears? Okay, I'm just gonna run my way through here. Oh lord, it's an eyeball dispenser. Um Wait, can we actually hit you? Yes we can. Um I'm not font. Oh if you could stop. Here we are. Oh, that money went away. Alright. Um, two paths, down or up. Well, considering the fact that this is a water dungeon, and there's probably a lot more water down below, let's go above ground. That running through everything seemed to work out quite a bit. I don't know if our shield can actually... I'm just going to try and take this as slow as possible. And just try to... Oh, you're just going to keep on... Oh, you can only dispense a max of, of three. Good to know. And you're just going to keep them coming, huh? Oh! Oh! That was close. Man, this is this is not good. Give me some of that money at least. Thank you. Ooh. Just jump, just jump. Do the ground and pound. Doesn't work against floating eyeballs. I should have known. Oh, there's a key! This was the right way to go! Excellent! And now we gotta go through all that garbage again! Um... Now the question is, do I want to use my potion, or do I want to use the heal spell for right now? You know what? Let's use the heal spell. And... Right? You know what? Should we use some of our other stuff? Your armor is stronger and slightly heals your wounds. Maybe I need to use that when I'm doing the jumps. I don't know how much... Okay, that takes two magic points. Hmm? I mean, I'm willing to try it out. I don't know how long it lasts. Ooh, I'm sparkly. Okay, just keep moving. Keep moving. Well, I'm not taking any damage. That's pleasant. <laughs> Just run. That had a pretty good time limit on it, actually. Let's do it again. Easy. Now, what I'm doing here... 
Oh, cool. Is I'm actually going to go back and save my game. So we have the key, always, and don't have to do that again. Easy. Ooh. Lots of nonsense. They dropped some good coin and XP. All right. Good, 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 good. No potion used. Just got to be careful. So... When it comes to these easy jumps, we're going to go ahead and just go with what we know. Ow! <laughs> right into the water. Okay, fine. Nah, we're committed. Let's just go. I like the music, though. So. Yeah, you guys just cool off there. Okay. And we're running. And heading down. Oh, God. Um. Oh, you guys, you throw spears. I hate this. Okay. Well, actually, never mind. I'm I'm okay. It's like as long as I can kind of kind of control where I'm going. Should be in decent shape. Animation almost killed me dead. No, two more paths. Where go? Where go? That last thing, that last strat actually helped out quite a bit, and this actually looks like the much more dangerous path. Poking out so many eyes. Oh, all right. It just looks like you gotta had to kind of pick your poison. That was very profitable for us. What's up here? No wall, no wall chicken. <laughs> Whoa! Was there anything good? I, you know, I'm not even gonna try. Going to assume that everything's cool. And now we know that we can block. I didn't know if I if I had repelled the shot back or if it blocked, but <sighs> um Yeah, may as well. Ew. So these look like these break. I'm kinda curious to tell you the truth. Um Nah. We like we like a special item or something there. <laughs> okay, game. I see you. our mana. I don't want to use that health potion unless I absolutely have to. Hmm. Okay. Just keep on going down. Ah! What did I just say? Good. good. 
was hi. And we can't go that direction. I wonder if this is where we get like a double jump. That'll be cool. Only one way to find out though. They do seem like literal frog people. Ugh. Don't take that personally, guys. Ooh, they are dancing. Dancing and hopping about. And you guys can just stay there. Ugh. Yep, yep. Oh. oh, no. From downtown. Um... I don't know what to think about this. Yeah, let's just, uh... Let's just head down here. This is more recon now, if for anything. Because we are about to die. Oh, there's something nice down there. No! This has to be the... Double jump. Okay. I'm... Kind of impressed I did that. <laughs> and the game's like, yep. That's what you get for being impressed with yourself. Um. So we've got to hurry quick, don't we? Does... I wonder if the shield does anything for us. Probably not. Okay, we're just gonna go. There we are. We're gonna work our way all the way around here. Yeah, it's definitely a ramp up in dungeon difficulty. I do not want to go up not when there's a path that takes us around to whatever that special item is. Um, I'm kind of scared if there's anything down there. Okay. Uh huh. I've got a long road ahead of me. I do want to explore this entire place. If I have to go back and save again, I will. If I think I can actually survive the attempt. Alright. Oh, no, no! Easy, easy. going to be another very, very fast jumping exercise. Yep, that is exactly what it is. <sighs> wow. <laughs> wow. Okay, more mana. Okay, well, fortunately, there was nothing, no baddies. Please tell me that's a double jump. Make my dreams come true. Sky call, up and attack. Be carried into the sky, unleashing a magical strat. Oh. 
Oh, cool. We've got Ken and Ryu's uppercut. Wait, can we? Ooh. I like that. So are these just like alternate paths we can take? Okay. Yeah. Aha. Whoop. Gotcha. Oop. I didn't forget you. Uh huh? At least they don't keep on jumping. That would suck. Thank you guys. Uh huh. I think we do need to go save. Do you think that's something we need to do? I feel we should, especially with this ability. I don't want to lose it and have to go through all that nonsense again. Oh! And we've got the... we got the cheat here. Yeah, I think we're gonna err on the side of caution. That's not cautious. Woo! Um. Oh, I used the potion. Like a derp. It's just habit. Oh well. What's done is done. <laughs> I will make my attack. Your way. Here we are. I mean, it's not horrible. Yeah, we can also shoot the axes back. Lovely. And... I like how you can control it, like, once it reaches its, its like, highest point. Actually, we may be able to level up our... Health. I think it was like 5,000? Heck. Maybe. I guess it depends on how much we kill on the way back. No jumping for you. Just death. And... Oh, that was, this is, this was dumb of me. Yep, that was really dumb of me. Hoy. Now we have to. Now we're kind of committed. Otherwise, we're going to do this again. There we go. I was not aware that that was a fast wheel. Or that was going the way we were running. I know we're being, like, we're erring on the side of caution here, but, um, I think that's gonna pay dividends for us. I still feel lame about using the health potion, but if I want to go all the way back, I can go all the way back and grab some potions at the inn. I am not above doing that. Yep, yep. Ooh. Come so far. Whew, right at the end. Hallelujah. Okay. And... Oh, it is 5,000 for an upgrade. Okay, give me... Let us pray. And let's go ahead and get... 5,000 XP. Health 5. I don't know how high they go, but... 
Maybe 10. That would be nice. And we'll just be back there. Just got to remember to... Now... Yep, yeah, I'm, I'm going to err on the side of caution here. I am going to go get a potion. Just because I figure... Okay. If anything, we have learned about the incredible usefulness of the shield spell. Just go and tank a bit. And all is well. And honestly, we got 352 gold. Okay. Get that good. We're going to head back to town. With the 352 gold, we can definitely get the rest of those upgrades that we needed. And we'll be able to attack this thing at full strength. Got to fight. We're gonna fight tactically here. Take advantage of the fact that we've got so many um, save points. And just go from. Them. I mean, I think we were doing pretty good, all things considered. I don't know if there's any other items in the dungeon, or if they. See, I'm always worried that it's gonna be one of those situations where. Oh dear. You always find one item in a dungeon, and you get used to that, and once you find, like, the skill or whatever, you're like, okay, we can go ahead and move on, and then you just completely miss something important, or something that can just make your life a lot easier, because you figured you already got it. Now these eyeballs are moving too slow. Now they've gotten used to the the very fast red eyes. That jump is still a little intimidating. Ah, uh, Arcos. Our friend is still there. Hello, friendos. Let us grab. Yes, please. Another potion slot. So I'm thinking maybe two... Well, no. It'd actually be better to have just mana potions. Because we get at least two heal... Yeah, okay. I see you, game. I should have noticed that ahead of time. And now we wield the power of day versus night. AKA, it's spooky. We need daytime. We'll call it the, the Lion King spell. Alright. Good, good, good. We still have the, the three lives, technically. But now the only thing we're out of, really, is excuses. Because so we've got all the upgrades that are available in this area. We've leveled up our health. We have three potion slots. Let's go ahead and head back. <laughs> you can go back and see the guy with the um, with the leak and realize that it could always be worse for him. Very, very worse. Oh man, those uh, those ghosts that go back and forth really fast, the specters or whatever, those would be a nightmare in this zone. If you're having to like jump on a platform. Um, well, better safe than sorry. Aha. 
when I think of these eye these eyeballs, all I think about is the Eye of Kilrog from Warcraft. Like, the warlocks can su summon it to check out stuff, but you also had to kill them very quickly. Otherwise, they were going to summon reinforcements. So let me go ahead and get hit real quick. Preferably where I can't get knocked. There we go. Do 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 do. Now we'll just buy the rest of this. Alright, I feel better. We will take a sleep. I mean, we could have just headed straight to back to uh, Stormheim Castle, but we'll get it daytime, just to say we did. I'm sure the beds are company are comfy. I'm trying to I'm trying to uh, stimulate the economy here. <laughs> They're under invasion. They need all the help they can get in these perilous times. There we go. Ooh. I thought I had jumped a little too soon. I was going to go right into the water. I was going to hate myself. And pray. Cool. All right, guys. Well, it's a little bit sooner than normal, but we have had um, several episodes run over 30 minutes, so I figure we can go ahead and end today's episode here. When we get back, now that we have this awesome ability, we'll be able to um, progress into those other areas we couldn't reach before, and hopefully find the boss here in Stormheim Castle. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you liked the episode, please leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, that'd be a big help. I will see you next time. Later days, everyone. <laughs>